So this horse walks into a bar and orders a beer, and the bartender says, sure, but why the long face? Long face? I got two more horse jokes, and I'm not going to tell them unless you laugh at them. Wonderful day, passing my way, knock on my door, even the score with your eyes, lovely to see you again, my friend. Walk along with me to the next bend. Coming, this is a great day. Um, we do this every year annually. We open the farm up to the public to, uh, to show them what we do here. This is a horse breeding farm. Uh, we bought the property in 1988, and my wife's name is Linda, and my name is Don. That's where Lindon came from, and you can see who the boss is. It's Linda, and I'm second in command. Um, we bought it in 1988 for a horse that we had that was pretty successful, and we wanted him to have a place to retire. So basically, we bought the farm for him. Uh, then we decided that probably we should have some babies, so we bought some mares and, um, and had a few babies, and it's just continued to grow. Today at the farm we have about 28 head. Um, we have, uh, in years past, when, when things were really flourishing and I was younger those days, uh, we had as many as 73 here at one time. Um, we've tried to cut back now. I'm, I'm in the legislature, so I don't have as much time to, to dedicate to the farm as I used to. Um, we, we breed the mares in the spring. Uh, they have their foals in the spring. A mare carries a baby for 11 months. Uh, we raise them up from babies. Um, the first weekend in November, which is coming right up, is when we wean the babies from their mothers and um, turn the mares back loose in the pasture and bring the babies up here to these paddocks uh, where we start handling them on a daily basis. And then a year later, um, when they're yearlings at about a year and a half old, is when we send them to the racetrack to be uh, broke to harness and broke to cart, or we send them to sales. Uh, some of these that we sell uh, go to some of the major sales in the country and we use the revenue from those yearlings to operate the farm with on a yearly basis. Um, this is a labor of love. Uh, we've been in the racing business for 25 years. Um, we love it here. We, lo we love having people come by and see what it is that we do. So we started this to do this about 12 years ago and it's really become very successful. And three years ago, the Maine Harness Racing Promotion Board, which promotes the harness racing industry, I encouraged them to do this statewide to promote the standard bred horse. So this is the third year that the, that the promotion board has is, is helped sponsor this and there are eight farms open today in Maine from Presque Isle to Berwick. Um, this is an annual event in October after we have our Sire Stakes Finals which were last week at Scarborough uh, which was a very successful weekend there, had a very big crowd. Um, people are really getting excited again about harness racing. Um, I think it's because about the animal. I don't think it has anything to do with the gambling at all. I think it's all about the love of the horse. And if you could see the people that are here today, there are, there are a couple of hundred people here probably, and probably we will reach three or four hundred before the day's over. Everybody's having a great time. Um, we take them out in the pasture, and I think you have some footage of that, uh, where they're on a wagon, where they can visit with the mares and babies and, um, and get up real close. So. Our cloud of fear is blowing away Now that you're here, you're going to stay Cause it's lovely to see you again, my friend Walk along with me to the next bend Tell us what you've seen In far away forgotten lands where in We don't do enough today to promote agriculture. Um, we don't, a lot of kids don't have the opportunity to get near agriculture. I think that's very important to keep open space and, and provide these children a chance to see what goes on at a farm. 
Won't you sing me back home a song? exhibition hall so yes I haven't grown up with farms but we were always in a community that had a lot of farms I really enjoy it I just it's a relaxing day and it's nice time to take photographs and both of kids and horses it's always nice to see families out enjoying the day with their kids I've got great grandkids coming up that I'll be bringing probably by starting next year Serious. You want her? Oh, said hi. Oh, said hi to everybody. Whoa! A wonderful day for passing my way. Knock on my door. Even the score with your eyes Lovely to see you again, my friend 